we got ourselves the boys dude what a variety of comps together with uh came out mal cutie came out cutie i really don't know we got came out we got us you watch yeah so uh we got it so philipson with also mayo and it's gonna be came out taking big down my goodness christina was just like k who k who k who who <laughs> gonna be awesome by actually knocking him out of self popping a bear for him with bar skin immediately does have zerkas rolling for now and that's gonna be pretty big defensive i think it was a proper defensive not an emergency heal does get a charge with asama as awesome is looking to get himself a bit of a reset and christina not letting him go anywhere trying to keep this man in combat is gonna hit him with the moonfire my cam is low the place can't tell if christina is the one lagging a bit or maybe it's just me but it's gonna be asama getting bled up getting thrashed up not able to really go anywhere trying to go for a bit of a door with shots that is going to be an interrupt available for christina does get a bash on asuma turn around with the kidding shot trinket for christina available as asuma goes in for the big shadow blades cloak shot is available for the bark skin that is going to be a short roar for christina trying to get himself a bit of a defensive does have emergency emergency roar emergency friends and regen to get him back up and running it looks like awesome is actually bleeding quite a bit he's going to go for shadow melt restell does get himself a shield but does break him out into combat it's going to be a moon fire to asuma if he can't get somehow a reset a clean one does he have a vanish? He does have a vanish. He could always vanish out unless Christina just stuns him now. There's going to be kidney shot lockdown. Bossima looking for the reset. Utilizing that rogue shield when restealthing before it's gone in 9 1, dude. Afterwards, it's going to be a little bit toughy for rogues to get that up and running. Christina looking for that eyeball immediately. Trying to see if he can get Asuma out. And Asuma going to be hugging that tombstone. Trying to see if he can get a fast one with a sap to Christina. Try to go for it. That was a roar by Christina. Almost got Asuma out. Did not say that cheap shot long at all. No chicken available for Christina. No chicken available for Asuma. This could be really bad. Christina going in for the bash. Does he have enough damage? Big combo. This bird is coming out. Bites. Wazoo. Blind. No chicken. Christina. Asuma survived that go without even a feint. Super lucky. Actually, really, really lucky. Gets a sap to Christina. Out of bear form. Does have a wall. Potentially an emergency self heal. So Asuma is going to be able to take him down just single handedly in a go. Does have advantage. Does have evasion. No more blind smoke bomb is available gonna be open or bacon a shot big damage to christina does activate the friends of region emergency heal but it's still super low health does wall that burst towards the tail end roar onto asuma and christina does look for recovery is going to try to use that wall in order to get some offensive damage going big bleeds onto asuma does have the bison finisher off asuma going for the vanish bear no health oh the brutal slashes are brutal actually sniping the rogue out of stealth well done for christina just kept spamming the spell and he was a okay yawashi is up next what's so who was it prior to this asuma and yawashi dude, how are you gonna put asuma and yawashi on the same team these two rogues dude these goons these ne'er-do-wells and these guys are getting that kidney shot just punch him right in the kidney go for reset although i think yawashi does not play that stealth the stealth shield so he is playing a, a more adaptable build for patch 9.1 so he should be okay for a bit Christina though out in the open, trigger back up and running, no wall available, dust of some cooldowns rolling though, and back up, Yawashi is coming in full clean, reset and ready to go, the only thing Yawashi hasn't dropped for preparation for patch 91 is cold blood, he might have to start looking at dropping it for the next patch, just see how he plays around it, or maybe this man is just straight up thinking of swap and hard swap to assassination as soon as the patch drops. Maybe he's getting ready. He is playing that Necrolord, which is pointed out, working out for him pretty well. That is extra common points. That is actually the same damage as well. The shield from Necrolord is also pretty huge. It depends which soul bind he's playing, which is either Merlith or the AoE fear with Emanim. Then he might have himself quite a few defensive toolkits to work with. He's going to get himself a sipping cup. Casita sticking in that bear form does not want to show him that soft exterior of a kitty cat kidney shot onto christina you watch this trying to see if he can make some damage happen getting those emergencies back to back trying to see if he might be able to get the emergency heal for christina does get it out so the next go he has christina will not have the emergency heal will have the bear form will have whatever self-healing you can but still bash onto yawashi and he's still hanging in there does get the slime shield so that's gonna be a mirrorless soul bind so that means whenever he goes for flesh craft, he does have CC immunity. Try to see if you just walk away from him. You can see it walking him around this card of Toxic Goo. Kidna Shot coming out with a cloak of shadows for the thorns. Shadow Blaze is up. Crusader does not have the emergency to heal. Does he go for the heal themselves? Does go for friends and regem? emerge the heal from the pharaoh most likely going to be back up next time you watch as a go christina really badly wants to get out of bear form and actually have a go did he just miss a bash onto your washing was that a bash that looked like the animation similar to that of a bash 
but I could be wrong. I definitely could be wrong. What is Miller Pala? My man's, we don't got Miller Pala. We got Philipson. We got Philipson. We got Biss in here. My Lord is on A, actually. That's why. That makes sense, actually. My Lord is on A. Big old roar by Christina. As you watch, looking to get more Shadow Strikes, more Blades. He's actually getting Christina kind of low. Christina is going to have to have a go in cat form at some point. Big Invasion available as soon as he pops into cat form. So that's a pretty big defensive use by the Rogue. Still played it super carefully. I mean, the difference between the Venti Rogue going for the all-out burst, all-out gameplay versus your watch he has more of a sustained build actually just staying kind of in melee with christina not completely staying away from him not going for as many like kidney shots sheep shots just on cooldown he's kind of just going for like setups trying to get cds out of christina so we'll see how it works out for him christina's trying to stay in bear form as best as he can again just trying to get whatever damage you watch he knows he does no damage in bear you watch he knows this too or at least not as much as he does in feral that is going to be the merge to heal out of Christina with Bars could use. So you watch, he just set himself a go. Has a Shadow Dance back up for the next go. Maim out of Christina, trying to make a big play here. Does he get the big bite? So watch, he is kind of in the open, but so is Christina. Being outside of bear form, puts him in a bad spot. Thorns, you watch, he does not have a cloak for it. He's going to go for a reset. Does not have, does have the shield. While in stealth, going to be a roar by Christina to knock him out. You watch, unless you have Shadow Meld. I think he just used Shadow Meld just to get himself a Shadow Strike onto Christina. Might have been really bad. Get a shot on Christina on Chicken available. You watch, it trying to make some damage happen. No emergency healing for Christina. But you watch, he has no health. The one time Christina got himself some damage over time onto you watch him. That was it. I think it's basically over. If we can just get more of those dots that you watch, he's looking for the reset, dude, trying to do what he can. Got us on a sip, become barely alive. This rogue is trying to see if he can maybe cheese it. Bash does have a chicken for it. Maybe turn around, still in bear form. And I think he's just going to get mauled by a bear. Blind back up, you watch him, will be able to reset unless Christina has some dots on you watch him. If he did, those dots just weren't as strong as he needed them to be. And that's going to be a reset for the rogue. Seven minutes into the duel. These rogues, dude, don't want to go down. This feral, though, literally bear forming it, man. Literally bearing through the damage, bearing through these rogues, dude. <laughs> so far, so far, Yawashi is doing a okay, though. Christina, I think, is a little ahead. What do we look at our cooldowns right now? Evasion up for Yawashi. Chicken available for Christina. Try to go for a roar onto Yawashi. Is able to auto attack him through the pillar. Kidna shot by Yawashi is going to be a bar skin. Trink it out of Christina. Is this why he just goes in for the most damage? Evasion is up for Yawashi. Next stun. Actually, it's going to be DR. Next, although, by the time evasion is over. That's gonna be really bad. Yawashi does get interrupted on his flesh scout. Christina tried to stay with thorns and bear form. He wanted to. Was that a bash? Did he try to go for a bash or was that a bear ability? Tell me that wasn't. Don't tell me that was a bash. I think it might have been. Could have shot reset for Yawashi. Christina is gonna have to go for a bit of a reset themselves too. Or maybe pick up the eyes to find the rogue. One set of eyes or one eye is still available in the corner. At least for the time being. And your watch is still looking for a bit of a reset himself. Waiting out for now. Eight minutes into this duel. 20% dampener. So the dampener isn't super high. Christina so far has been able just to take up this damage. But he knows that if he leaves cat form, he could be locked out in a stun lock combo while in cat. And it could be really bad. Trying to go for a big convoke and a bash onto you. Watch it. Big bites to follow. Gonna be a vanish for you. Watch it. Does Christina find him? Gonna be a shadow strike for you. Watch it. Get a shot. Does he get to turn around? Shadow blades and everything. I think he might just have it. Big heal available for Christina. Thorns are up and everything. Cloak shot is still up for you. Watch it. Big bites are still going through. Novation for this one. And that's gonna be a rogue trying to catch that reset, but the brutal slashes to get him out. And that bite is gonna cap it out. So far, Christina have had a very brutal, brutal bit of gameplay here. With Philipson up next as a retribution paladin, looks like he's gonna just have to let Christina get himself a bit of a reset. Can use consecration to maybe get the feral out, or at least prevent the feral from opening on him. That's gonna be an opener by Christina. Three media trinket for Philipson. I think he knows that uh, Christina doesn't have a trinket. Seraphim is up. Stun available. Big hammer proc. Oh, the final verdict, dude. The final wreck. And that's it, dude. And that was over. Out of all the bursts, I think the the Feral Burst and the Pally Burst are saying basically the same. Am I wrong in that one? Am I wrong with that? DWDW. DDW. DW? D? I'll just call you D. Look at D. Look at D go. Oh. 
Trying to go for a bit of damage does force out a bubble out of Philipson though. So it's a pretty big defensive and D might be able to finish off here. Shield finishes up. Zuen is available for damage. Does put some of the damage. Gonna be a big dampen harm. Big. Oh, Karma onto the Pala and D taking them out. Just trying to brute force it while weapons of Warden and Zuen was still up and running. Maya, Mayo, Maya, Mayo, Mayu is up next as a feral droid. Is he Necrolord? Is he Fey? Trying to go for a bit of a Necrolord. Okay, trying to go for a bit of a bleed with a monk. Does drop him down. That is Karma out of the way. Owlkin is up next. A Boomy versus a Feral, huh? Flash Craft is up. Could go for maybe an interrupt. Doesn't go for an interrupt. Maya, did he get a restart? I think he does. Oh, Typhoon does knock him out, I think, at least out in the open. Bash onto Maya and Alkin should be able to get himself a couple of rats in. Thorns? Was that Thorns available for one of them just now? It looked like for Alkin it was Thorns. Did it cancel it? Potentially. Alkin, does he play the Convoke build? Or does he play maybe Necrol? I don't know if Boomy can play Necrol. Or gonna be a main, but Mayu got himself full bleeds on the Alkin. Barskin is up for the Druid. Actually, both of them are Druids. When I say both the Druid, you guys have no idea which one I'm really mean. Alkin popping the bear from trying to go for a cyclone. Does he get the skull bash to trap? No skull bash to trap. Does force the trick out of Mayu. And Alkin goes back into bear from trying to take up the damage. That's going to be bad. Master trick up. Going for another cyclone. Going to be a full bash out of the feral. Another cyclone available. No stops here. And regrowths are available for Alkin, but at 38% dampening. Those are reduced. He does need himself a heal. He does have quite a few resources to work with. It looks like Thorns is up for Alkin, but it looks like he cancels the Thorns maybe. Or the storm still show up. Big damage at Alkin. Might have to go for big renewal. Renewal was used. Got him caught back up. And I think Friends of Region might have been used there as well. But eventually we'll have to go aggressive against the Feral Druid. Try to go for big Celestial Lyman. Big damage. Kyrian set up. Trying to make the most of the Star Surges and the Kyrian go. But that badge does not last long enough for you to get a full setup with the Boomy. I feel like at that point as a Boomy you almost want to be super far away from the enemy. So you can really get the ramp rolling. It's a bit of a ramp to set up your burst. And I guess a Pharaoh, that is a little tough. That is rough, man. Biz trying to see if he might be able to cap out the Feral. No trinket available for Mayo. Didn't pre wall this is in bear form. And Biz, I think, just trying to go for the big carry and go. Does he have enough damage here? Big wreck blind. Mayu does wall this blind. And Biz knows he can't really do much. Is going for Word of Glory. It's Biz himself taking a bit of damage from the Thorns. Bash onto the Paladin. Mayu trying to see if he can get the hell out of Dodge. Does get himself friends of region. Trying to go for a little bit of heals over time. Could swarm on top of it to enhance the amount of healing he has. There's going to be Flashcraft on top of all those Haas that are rolling. So he does himself quite a bit of health protection and got himself health recovery. Catching himself a re-stealth maybe with a shot mode? I think it might have been with a shot mode. There's no way he just got out of combat randomly. And Mayu shield is still holding strong. Biz does have himself yet another set of wings. Barskin is up for Mayu. Does catch up on full health, dude. That swarm with a little bit of a self heal rolling rejuve. Maybe even a frenzy region in between. While Flashcat was holding. I mean, he just caught back up to full health. He's in a great position. Thorns is up. And Biz is going to take a lot of dot damage. Unless he wants to bubble this, which he might have to. Try to see if he can deny the bubble. With Word of Glory's bubble does come out. And looking to get aggressive. Counter aggressive with Mayu. Got himself holy power building. No wings for about a minute. Does he have Seraphim and Wreck? That's going to be tricked back up for Mayu. So Biz better get his trinket out as early as he can with a Hodge or a Blind or something. The earlier you can do, the better. Got about 45 seconds on his wings. Got a Hodge onto Mayu. Isn't bear for him. So he's A-OK -okay as Biz doesn't have any damage rolling. No cooldowns running. Seraphim is up and running. Big hammer onto Mayu. Could be a, bop out of, a blind out of Biz. Looks like he doesn't go for it. Going to be a root with a cycle trying to make it happen. Wreck onto Mayu. Taking lots of damage. Does he go down either way though? Big hammer's flying. Looks like he... Oh my god. The gal is slamming down. At the end. I was thinking Biz is going to have to go through a trinket. You know what? He just went through that hell bar. He just ignored that trinket. He was like, you know what? I got damage. I'm a paladin. What to it? Christina with a big show of force at the start. But team one did bring it back a little bit. To the point where almost everybody got to...